Hi guys, it's Legionero back with another video. And today I'm going to um, do some planning in this mini happy planner. This is a vertical happy planner. Um, I found this on clearance at Hobby Lobby. It was $5.99, somewhere around in there. Um, so I grabbed it. I like <laughs> I do love the Happy Planner, even though I use an Erin Condren hour, hourly. I do love the Happy Planner. Um, I have a ton of Happy Planner books. I'm sure I've said that a couple of times here on the channel. And I'm, I'm very fond of the many Happy Planners. I like the vertical and the horizontal. I like the horizontal because you can write notes um, in there. You can kind of keep it as a... Um, Kind of journal of sorts to write down how your day went um, or you can use it as a regular planner and then I like the vertical as well I think I like the horizontal better because it has the lines in it but I like the vertical as well this one is the vertical I'm not really sure what I'm actually going to use this for because I have a planner for sewing I have my daily planner <laughs> Um, I think at this point I am just obsessed um, with stickers and planners. Um, I've been using Happy Planner for a while. Um, that's why I have so many sticker books and different things like that. <laughs> but I think, um, you know that Allstate commercial uh, where he's on the exercise bike and he's like, you've gone from zero to obsessed. <laughs> That's how I feel like that's what I feel like is going on with me and um, planning right now in stickers. So I just laid down a Mother's Day sticker here um, and I'm going to use this um, the Encourager sticker book by Happy Planner. It's um, not sure how old it is. I picked it up. I, I can't remember when I picked it up, but it's a mini sticker book. I'm not real sure if they still have these. Um, I'll definitely check the website and, in the, and if they do, I will link it below. But it's just a mini planner, mini planner, mini stickers. And I'm just going to lay down some stickers, some encouraging stickers to kind of encourage myself um, through the month of May, because it's going to be a very busy month. And I'm definitely going to need some encouragement to get through. Um, so, like I said, I'm not real sure what exactly I'm going to use this for. So, this is just basically me laying down some stickers and just decorating the planner. Gonna have to um uh, find uh, I'm gonna have to cut off this tie here on the sticker book and put it <laughs> in the holes here because um, the pages are coming out. So that's something you can do if you find you have a Happy Planner sticker book and the pages are coming out. Um, just go ahead and cut off your um, the elastic and then just tie it all right so really didn't want to do too much to the month but I did want to do the week <laughs> so that's the month just laid down some cute little stickers and then if whatever I decide to do with this planner I still have ways to um Spaces to write things in. Like I said, I use an Erin Condren hourly mostly. And um, that's where I do most of my plans. 
I think I'm just obsessed now with decorating things. <laughs> And I mean, I have all of these stickers, sticker books and stickers and planners and whatnot. Might as well use them. I may use this for um, I have a training that starts here on May the 2nd. So I may use this for that just to kind of write down important dates and things that I know I'm going to have to do in that class. The class is a month and a half long. So training for a job. So yeah, that's what I think I'll use this for. And even though I'm just kind of laying down some stickers, I can still use this. There's still plenty enough room to write down things during the week. But it will just be pretty. <laughs> So yeah, I think that's definitely what I'm going to use this planner for. I'm going to just write down important things from the training and the class. I'm looking for a doll to put down. I see one, but it's not the right color. The background is not the right color. I love how they have these um, layered stickers in here. So you don't have to do your own layering. Hopefully I got another girl in here. I wanted a girl with a purple shirt on. I wanted a smaller one though. Um, the ones that I have in here are too big for that particular box. So I'm just gonna have to go back and use the one she has on purple-ish pants, I guess. All right. All right, so let's put down some things. To write some things down. I like the sticker book because you can um, put down things like, I think it says random acts of kindness and has stickers like that in here. I think that's super, super cool. usually don't mind if my stickers are crooked but that was way way off there we go that was a little bit better that sticker is a little big for 
that box, but that's okay. Oh, the purple that I'm looking at is way too big. I want to put something in one more box and then I'll be done. And I still have empty boxes where I can write in. I can write in these spaces here as well. I think I'll just put this quote sticker down because it incorporates most of the colors. All right. So yeah, like I said, I think I'm just, uh, I've gone from zero to obsessed. <laughs> um, even thinking about making some, some small stickers for the mini happy planner. Um, but this is this week. Um, like I said, I start the class here on Monday. It runs through, I think, June 15th or something like that. So I think that's what I'll use this planner for. I will write down need to knows, things to remember, different things like that in this mini happy planner. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.